stamp. So maybe find the star stamp. So grab the star as your stamp in the annotation menu. And then on the EcoCycle, place a star where your facilitation practice is right now. So when you think of your practice as a facilitator, where is that in, uh, in the EcoCycle? Do you feel your practice is mature? Are you getting good results with your facilitation practice? Is it, uh, sorry, so Tobias, Ooh, annotation, you're on an iPad, Tobias. Does anybody know where the annotation button is on an iPad? I'm not sure I do. For other folks, in case there are other people. Okay, cool. So on an iPad? For, it looks like Tobias is at least on a MacBook. Um, yeah, and the, I think everything on an iPad shows if you go um, up on your screen and touch the screen, and then you see additional options. No. no, okay. <laughs> so for those of us that are on MacBooks and on Macs, um, you basically go up to the very top where it says view options. There's that green bar and it says view options. And under the drop down there, there's a selection to annotate. And then a little toolbox, a little bar will come up. It'll pop up. It's not showing up for you, Samir. I see your face. Um, it's not showing. Um, so for those of us, that's that's what it looks like when you are got a functioning Zoom annotate for those of us that are on a MacBook. Um, and then it'll pop up like a series mouse, text, draw, and then there's stamp option. So if you're not seeing that, sometimes the you are viewing and that option comes up on the bottom. So you can try there too. And then for Windows, does it look the same folks that are on Windows? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It should look the same. So wherever it says that you're viewing F and Anna's screen, it should be right in those view options. Yeah, there's a green bar, and then next to the green bar is a little view options drop down menu. And within that drop down menu is annotate. If you need to, once you have the annotation menu open, if you need to clear your own marker. You can either use the eraser or uh, the trash can it says clear and you can clear uh, clear your drawing or your marking. So, you know, here's, here's the first image or view of where people see their facilitation practice right now. So, you know, there's a lot of people who are maybe still in the gestation phase. They're you know, that might mean that they've gone through this cycle four or five times as a facilitator <laughs> and they've come back around to renewing their practice. For other people, that might mean like, I'm just getting started. I don't even really think of myself as a facilitator. Uh, so there's lots of potential ways to interpret this. Um, and with this kind of collective snapshot, um, you know, we in this group, depending on how people interpreted the invitation to think about their facilitation practice and where it is, have at least a nice distribution of people in various, uh, various phases. Uh, right now, it doesn't quite look like anybody sees themselves as rigid as a facilitator. Uh, there might be particular practices <laughs> that we do have that are rigid. Um, and perhaps if we invited other people to map us, they might place us in different phases than we see ourselves. So, you know, so this is your own, um, what would you call it, subjective view of yourself. 